with your storm team weather. Here's Chief Meteorologist Aaron Ayers, sponsored by Jim Bass Cars and Trucks. Well, the heat is back for us here in the Concho Valley. The good news is, though, that it's not as hot as it has been in the past couple of weeks here in the Concho Valley. And we've got a quiet pattern setting up for us over the next several days. Hot days ahead of us, though. Temperatures close to 100. High pressure in place for us. That's going to lead to some sunny and warm conditions over our weekend. So let's get right into it. Taking a look at conditions out at the airport at Mathisville. Right now, we're at 99 degrees. It feels like 95 with humidity at 17%. Winds out the northeast at 16 miles per hour uh, across the area. Current temperatures across the area, across Texas, the Lone Star State, heating up 96 over in Midland, 99 here in San Angelo, 101 in San Antonio, Austin at 100, 96 over in Waco. So definitely feeling the heat for us across the state of Texas. And we're going to continue to feel that heat over the next five days. 96 on Thursday, not as hot. But then on Friday, 100, 98 on Saturday, and 99 on Sunday and into next Monday. So we're going to expect above normal temperatures for us over the next five days. So let's get right to the radar where we're not seeing any type of showers or thunderstorms to bring us any type of heat relief. Just some clouds out there picked up on the radar. As we take a wider view of the region, we'll see some light showers and some clouds and they're starting to fade out here as they come down towards the Concho Valley and I really think most of those are going to fizzle out before they make it here to the Concho Valley area but needless to say they will bring some clouds to the area overnight tonight and into tomorrow morning. Here's our current surface map setup. We have a low pressure system over in Alabama and the cold front that trails through southern Alabama, southern Mississippi and into portions of New Orleans, Louisiana and then turns into a stationary boundary back into Texas. But here in our area, we've got this Colorado high. That's the big dominating factor in our weather over the next several days. And it's just going to hang out there over Colorado for the next several days. Our high-res future cast as we go into this evening. Temperatures in the upper 80s, low 90s around 8 o'clock. Some of those clouds making their way into the northern portion of the Concho Valley. They're going to stick around. In fact, a few more stream in here tomorrow morning with some isolated showers possible throughout the Concho Valley early on your Thursday morning with temperatures in the 70s as we roll this forward through our Thursday afternoon. Temperatures getting into the 90s, upper 80s, low 90s for us, and then eventually into the upper 90s again on Thursday with some cloud cover. Our extended future cast this week remaining hot and dry. Highs in the 90s, 100s for us. Thanks to that Colorado high in place over Colorado providing us with sinking air as we go into this weekend. Mostly sunny conditions. Highs in the 90s as we go into next week. Same story. Mostly sunny. Highs in the 90s all the way into next Wednesday. And if you are planning to maybe grab some ice cream this weekend. It's going to be a nice weekend to do that. Sunny conditions, temperatures in the upper 90s, so a nice way to cool off is with some ice cream this weekend. And as we take a look at conditions tonight, 67 degrees for a low tonight, mostly clear for us overnight tonight. And as we go into our Thursday, some partly cloudy conditions throughout the day. Temperature getting up to 96 degrees in the afternoon. Winds out of the east-northeast at around 5 miles per hour. And as we go through the next five days here in the Concho Valley, expect the heat to be up for us as we we go into the weekend with temperatures close to 100 degrees, sunny conditions over the weekend. And as we go into next week, mostly sunny conditions, temperatures still topping out close to 100 degrees. We'll be back on KCN News.